The best food processors make life easier when you're cooking for a crowd or simply prepping for a meal for one. They effortlessly blitz through dicing, slicing, grinding and kneading. We've thoroughly tested a wide range of food processors from leading brands such as Ninja, KitchenAid, CuisineArt, NutriBullet and MagicBullet and our tests put the best food processors through their paces, judging their functionality and efficiency through performance, cleaning and ease of use. We have listed the top 5 food processors and their key features, plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all products mentioned in the video are in the description below. You could also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website validconsumer.com. Number 5. KitchenAid 13 Cup Food Processor KitchenAid is a beloved brand when it comes to kitchen appliances and its 13 cup food processor checked all of my boxes when it came to features I found desirable. The puree function tended to be more of a metric than chop among the food processors in this lineup and while all the models I tested here eventually produced a perfectly worthy hummus, this KitchenAid model did so quickly and with less noise than any other model, churning out a silky puree that was nearly restaurant quality in its texture. Food processors can be fussy when it comes to the locking bowls and lids that ensure the safety measures are in place to prevent blades from spinning out of control, but this model's lightweight stack design allows for particularly easy assembly. This is not nothing when considering whether it's worth the effort to take the food processor in and out of the cabinet. The fussier the mechanics, the more likely you are to forego the food processor and just go the manual route. Some of my favourite features of this model have to do with its easy storage capacity. The slicing shredding discs and dough hook all fit in a compartment that fits within the bowl. And the base of the model includes a coil for wrapping the cord. Very few models are this self-contained with all of their parts, making this a food processor that's always worth employing. Number 4. Ninja Professional 9 Cup Food Processor For under $200, we were more than pleased with all the Ninja Plus Professional Food Processor's extra features and attachments, especially since nearly everything is dishwasher safe. There are several different buttons to find the perfect setting for every task. During our testing, the food processor chopped an onion and sliced a zucchini evenly without crushing them. While it grated two different kinds of cheese well, we did notice some leftover cheese underneath the lid. The setup and attachments are not necessarily intuitive, and the blade sits farther up in the bowl, which can be frustrating. We noted that this model is not well suited for bigger batch recipes. However, despite this, our testers said they would not only recommend this model to a friend, but would consider buying one for themselves due to the great value and overall usefulness of the features. All in all, our testers describe this food processor as a slam dunk. Number 3. Magimix Compact 5200XL Chrome 1100W Food Processor This machine comes with three bowls so you can work with small to extra large amounts of food and use one after the other. When you're done, the bowls nest inside the machine for convenient storage. There are three buttons for easy operation, and the induction motor adjusts the amount of power used so it can power through dense materials easily. The wide feed tube accommodates large foods, while the three-stage pusher can handle different sized ingredients without them tipping over or cutting unevenly. The chopping blades, to fit separate bowls, are made by Sabatier, so they are knife quality. The proprietary blender mix insert moves the food around in the bowl, so it blends more smoothly and results in a creamy texture, like a blender. The special dough blade mixes and kneads even dense bread dough. The whisk can whip cream or beat egg whites, just like a standard mixer. This also includes 2 and 4 mm slicing discs and 2 and 4 mm grating discs, a spatula for easy cleaning, a free recipe app, a storage case and a citrus juicer. The juicer was the most exciting addition for us. We were able to juice half a grapefruit down to the rind in just a few seconds. We were very pleased with this machine's performance across the board. Number 2. Cuisine Art DFP 14 BCNY 14 Cup Food Processor A true kitchen workhorse, this doesn't have a lot of frills but will get the job done easily. The brushed stainless steel food processor has two large paddle buttons, one for on and one for off slash pulse, which are all you really need. The 14 cup work bowl is large enough for family cooking and has an extra large feed tube with large and small pushes, so you won't need to cut ingredients to make them fit. This includes one shredding disc, one slicing disc and a removable disc stem that fits both, along with a metal blade for chopping, mixing, blending and emulsifying. We were impressed with how well the machine needed dough and it was easy to use aside from assembling the attachments for the first time. They did note that this machine was somewhat tricky to clean 
that it was a great value for an average price food processor. One of our friend's parents has had the same food processor for decades and it still works like new. Cuisine Art makes some of the best food processors out there for home kitchens and this model really exemplifies that. Number 1. Breville 16 Cup Sous Chef Peel and Dice Food Processor Breville touts this as a product so handy that it can act as your own personal sous chef. We found this to be true during our testing thanks to its performance and incredible features. The Breville sous chef was able to evenly shred our cheeses and slice our zucchini. In fact, it was so effective at slicing the zucchini that there was no wasted zucchini at the end of testing. It also produced mostly small and uniform onion pieces, although there were some chunks left over. Our tester told us that the onion was chopped so finely that it almost formed a paste. When it came to mixing the mayo though, the performance surprisingly fell flat. The machine successfully mixed the mayo, but it took scraping the sides down two or three times until we got it right. Included with this product are three blades and five cutting discs, including a slicing disc that has 24 different settings. It also comes with a large and small mixing bowl, the latter of which can fit 2.5 cups worth of ingredients. You also get three shoot options, a storage unit and a cleaning brush, which makes it easy to get into the nooks and crannies of smaller pieces. Plus, you can actually program on the control panel how long you want your processor to mix. Overall, our tester said, this product would be great for any home cook who wants all the bells and whistles. It would be good for anyone who hosts events and needs to do a lot of prep. So that wraps up our list of the best food processors. Hope you found this video helpful, and if so, please leave a thumbs up, as I always appreciate that. Let us know in the comments down below which food processor you're going to choose. Thanks for watching, and that's all for this video. If you like this video and it helped you in any way, please give this video a like, and if you don't want to miss out on any future videos, subscribe to the channel. Hope to see you in the next video. Till next time, see you guys later.